Jumbo Jumbo everyone and welcome to my channel. Today I bring to you an interesting game against a team. They are very very strong. They have all the new toys and everything against me or us who have regular multi-function uh, fun hanger. And uh, I would also like to talk about how to recover from a heavy attack. Um, so if you like the content, uh, please subscribe, share and uh, also if you can help to spread and uh, tell everybody about my channel, they get to see the content that I provide and uh, hopefully everybody likes it. Um, so I start here with my uh, hawk because I know now it's the uh, shell matter and I try to take down as many shell as, as possible. Uh, my thinking was these guys they will be bringing uh, the shells in the beginning and then uh, after that it should be easy for us to deal with. So let's see what we can do in this game. Uh, let me look around what I can do. This shell is coming home. Let, let's hook him and he's out and that guy as well. Yep. And this guy. Oh, he's... Uh, so we have this one guy. He's a friend of mine. Tala Musk. Very nice guy. So we try to get him. My clocking unit is ticking. He's trying to push the other beacon as well. Um, and uh, hopefully I get him. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, he got my last hand. Oh, my flight was ready and he got me. They have three beacons. We'll, we're fighting for our home beacons. And uh, this is what I wanted to talk about. Um, if you have a heavy attack of uh, strong players like this, what you need to do is you push for their home beacons. You keep four players. These four players, they fight for your home beacons. And one player uh, goes for their flank beacon and the other player goes for the center beacon. This way, you will be able to push the enemy back and you will be able to release some tension which is coming to your home. If you leave them coming home, you want to do your damage, then the game will end very fast. Uh, this game we were not on comms or anything, we were just uh, uh, running for fun and uh, it was not only uh, moon players, we had one friend of ours, Asas, very good player uh, from USSR and uh, now uh, these guys are still attacking us with the uh, scorpion, there's nightingale at home. So the attack is still going on. These guys, they never stop attacking. And I see our two players here. I leave immediately because you must distribute your players as much as you can. I thought the shell bots, we finished killing them. But to my surprise, watch this game and see how many shells, how many hawks and how many scorpions these guys have man it was crazy and uh, it's very very difficult to fight this kind of uh, uh, clans with uh, a fun hanger like mine uh, because uh, there's no air to breathe you're just going to be busy 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 all the game so i'm looking around here we have recovered uh, as we did i went uh, forward there one of my colleague he went for center so now these guys they realize that okay now we know who we are dealing with so that was the whole purpose we kept two beacons and we are now sending one or two players to do attack to their home beacons so that they are busy at their home and uh, we are also busy because they are doing the same thing um, if even if you are in a, in a solo game or you are in a duo game if you face this kind of attacks uh, sometimes even the solo players do they just keep attacking you so you 
need to push and uh, send two players for their flank and also uh, for their for the center beacon while four players are fighting for the home beacons that way you will be able to release the amount of uh, attack you are having at home um, so i got this ravana on his last end because he didn't see me and uh, now i died there in center uh, beacon bar is not in our favor and uh, these guys uh, for my type of hanger they are very very strong and uh, they have all the new toys and everything so it's very very difficult uh, for me uh, to deal in our team here we have some players who have a similar uh, top toys like them but it's not enough uh, even if you have one player who doesn't have meta bots uh, it's difficult to fight uh, them but we try our best uh, we kept two beacons, uh, we are giving them hard time, not like the way they thought that they will just come and bombard us. And uh, I tried to lock that hawk but I couldn't. Now I try to get this leech but he's leeching. So I'm just waiting a little bit for his ability to end and trying to get this hawk. Because these guys never stop. Hawk, scorpion, shell. Hawk, scorpion, shell and uh, they're losing a lot of bots that's what we thought we would do a last minute push and now they have dropped with their titans they have uh, two nordens at the moment and uh, nordens are not easy to take down if there are multiple of them i lock this shell another shell we just kill like three four shells and another shell comes we get this guy out of uh, the picture now i try to lock that guy which i did there's a nightingale in center which is they're trying to keep the beacon because now they realize that oh these guys are they know what they're doing so i try i lock this guy but uh, i won't be able to do much damage because man they are three nodens on the battlefield so i was taken down and this is my last bot which is the arthur beacon bar is completely not on our side and uh, our players are trying to push the center and uh, healing each other and uh, here i thought i kill this uh, nodens first and then move forward but i saw a player died in center and there is this nightingale who's trying to keep the beacon so I had to choose to either push for center and kill this nightingale or stay on the home. But the beacon bar is not in our favor. So I better go and uh, push for the center. So I think these guys all what they have now is titans. After Titans, I don't think they have any bots. They use all their bots just to push, 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 push. Uh, the Nightingale who just passed me, I think uh, uh, he got one of the beacons. And this is how the game went. Please subscribe, share and turn on the notification bell. Thank you very much and bye bye